So just wanted to make a quick MLB news video for you guys talking about the New York Yankees and Yoshinobu Yamamoto this 2023-24 MLB offseason. So here on the screen is a tweet from Fireside Yankees on Twitter which says, according to Joel Sherman, if they quote spend any big money this offseason, it'll be on highly coveted NPP, uh, NPB starter Yoshinobu Yamamoto who just won his third straight triple crown and will likely win his third straight MVP. Will the Yankees end up with Japan's top arms? So so this offseason, Yoshi, uh, Yoshinobu Yamamoto is going to be posted by the Oryx Buffaloes going over to North America, and there's going to be a lot of players or a lot of teams interested in his services, right? This guy is a phenomenal player, only 25 years old, about to win his third straight Cy Young, already won his third already won his Thursday Triple Crown, and at just 25 years old, that's pretty damn impressive if you ask me, right? Uh, this guy put up, I believe, 17 wins last year, six losses, an ERA of 1.16. Those are pretty awesome numbers in the Japanese Baseball League. So if he's able to go over to North America, uh, this guy could perhaps be getting, you know, north of $200 million and, and an even higher contract than what Tanaka got uh, when he signed with the Yankees all the way back uh, and I believe the early 2010s, if I'm not mistaken, whatever the case was, uh, he sent a pretty big ticket back in the day. But uh, yeah, if the Yankees are able to spend big time money on this player and actually get him, this could be a pretty good signing for them. Now, the only, I guess, other side, the flip side of this coin, I guess, would be if they spend all their money on Yamamoto. What else can they possibly be doing this offseason when this team has quite a bit of holes to fill, especially offensively, in regards to some outfield uh, left-handed bats, for instance? So uh, I think this rotation has the potential to bounce back this year with players like uh, hopefully Carlos Don finding his game once again. If Nestor Cortez can come back healthy, he could be a good player. Garrett Cole, of course, had a pretty phenomenal year this past year. So uh, if you're able to add someone like uh, Yoshinobu Yamamoto to this rotation, this could arguably be the best free agency, uh, best free agency signing besides Shoei Otani this offseason. So, you know, is, could he be going to the Yankees? I guess only time will tell. It all really depends on what... Uh, Brian Cashman and the Yankees are going to be doing. Uh, do they want to spend money on top end players like Yamamoto? Do, do they want to spend money on maybe some other players like Kevin Kiermaier? Maybe explore the trade market, whatever the case may be. I guess only time will tell, but if you're a Yankees fan, leave all your thoughts down below. If I hear anything else, I'll make sure to make a new video updating you guys about it. But until then, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.